part of the pyramid that I'm really trying to help them out with and teaching them is um, relationships and environment and um, individual strategies by showing the kids that we had um, a picture schedule of what we already did, then what we were currently doing, and then what we were doing next. And my group time, um, we have a flip chart that shows them what's happening next and what we're currently doing. And then I also show the picture schedule so they can see we're doing four things throughout the group. So the kids have kind of started their own little um, strategy of letting themselves know what was happening through a group by when I would flip the chart they would say completed, like story is completed, and they love saying that big word. So I've really encouraged them to continue using it. Setting up group time this way has helped them answer um, four questions. Um, how do I know what I'm doing? How do I know that I am progressing? How do I know that I'm done? And then how do I know what is next? I mean, using that flip chart is really giving them a good visual. So with the relationships, we've been talking a lot about feelings. So we always do like a social skill that may have to do with a feeling, um, uh, the book that has to do with the feeling. So with the environment, um, I'm really trying to purposely, you know, get, place the children's names on the rug the way I know that they can participate best. And then I'm also giving them specific praise throughout the group time of, you know, I, you're following the group rules and I have them displayed as well. And also for environments, um, I'm using topics that they're very interested in um, and books that they really like and, and doing those over and over again. And then f for the individual strategies part of the pyramid, um, I think about the things that might help each child participate to their best. Um, I place children close to me and you'll see one child who really enjoyed touching the pages. So she helps me turn all the pages for every book. And then after I'm done, I, I let her hold it because she really likes to see it up close. 